Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Fatima Qureshi. Today I have a patient with me and he has given his consent for this uh, particular video. A lot of you have been asking or you guys come to the clinic talking about corneal problems from contact lens overwear, right? Mm -hmm. So this is a young adult and like him, there are many students, uh, college going uh, you know, uh, patients and even uh, uh, older patients who wear contact lenses but they overwear contact lenses. What do they do? They sleep in contacts, right? So there's a whole concept saying, oh, it's extended wear, you can sleep in contacts, but that's wrong. The FDA doesn't approve that, American Medical Association doesn't approve that, American Optometric Association does not approve that, and CDC, Center for Disease Control, does not re uh, recommend that at all. And as doctors, as physicians, we don't recommend. So, Josh, what happens when you sleep in contacts? What happens? Tell, tell the audience a little bit. Um. What it, like what it, what it feels like? Yeah. Um, you wake up, have more or less like dry eye, um, and you also can't see that well. I feel like it's uh, it, you can't uh, see as far as, it, and it's not as sharp and clear. Correct. And then when he comes to us with a corneal abrasion, which is a scratch on the cornea, sometimes corneal ulcers also, then we have to treat them. Right, Josh, you've had those corneal abrasions, and because of the corneal abrasions, he has scars on his cornea now. So I'm gonna quickly show you this model that we have here. This is the eye model, and this is where all the blood vessel growth happens on this cornea. This is the part where the contact lens sits, right? And so the blood vessels come, and that condition is known as corneal neovascularization. Because the cornea, you guys have to understand, is an avascular structure. It doesn't have its own blood supply. When you start sleeping in contact lens, that blood supply or the oxygen that it gets is depleted. When there's no oxygen, it's dying literally, right? So new blood vessels come and grow on the cornea. That is known as neovascularization, which means new blood vessel growth. That's a bad sign. But the good thing about uh, Joshua is that he started listening to me, right? Mm -hmm. And last time when he came, he said, yes, I will listen to you. And today, a year later, his neovascularization and those blood vessel growth have decreased somewhat the scars are not going to go away, unfortunately, okay? So the lesson learned is what, Joshua, you tell us. Uh, take your contacts out every night. <laughs> every night, take it out. You go to brush your teeth, just like that, you take out your contacts. How long does it take to take a contact lens out? Two seconds. Yeah, two seconds. Yeah, awesome. So do not sleep in contact lenses. Thank you.